What's going on my people, then it's your boy Kyron Julius back for another strong Sunday's number six, my dog. Hey listen, my dad, he told me an interesting story once when he started a new head chef role in a private school. Now it was a great job for him because he didn't have to work on Saturdays anymore. So it didn't conflict with his Sabbath keeping. But there was a small problem. His team liked to go to the local pub every so often for a little social. And whilst everyone would order their lagers and their beers, ciders and stuff, my dad would order an orange juice because he doesn't drink alcohol as he believes as a Christian, he shouldn't. One lady in particular though, always tried to convince my dad to have a drink. Oh, come on, mate, just have one drink with us. It's not gonna hurt ya. My dad never budged though. He always stayed rooted. Until one day he asked her, why do you keep asking me to have a drink with you when you know I don't drink? And she replied, because I wanted to see how strong you were to your word of being a Christian. Martin. Here's the thing. You see, the creator gives us many examples through his word, the Bible, on how we should be more like his people. One of the examples he gives is that we should be more like salt. Take this scripture in Luke 14, verse 34 to 35. Salt is good, but if salt has lost its flavour, how can it season? Flavourless salt is worth nothing. You might as well throw it away. Now this scripture here made a lot more sense when I heard my dad's story in her. In other words, saying you're Christian is great, but if you're all words and no action, your words to your faith mean nothing. You see, for me, it was easy for me to be Christian around other Christians, but put me in front of other people who didn't really believe the same way I did, led their lives a different way, did things that was kind of a temptation or out of my morality, but kind of looked good or felt good. Hey, it was a different look of moral with me. I wonder if other people feel the same way. You see, there's always an opportunity for people to taste Christ and that's for you. So don't lose your taste because you don't want to be flavorless in this life. And for those of you who want to be smart and say that salt ain't just seasoning, yes, we know you got the all-purpose and you got the paprika, you got the cumin and the curry powders and jerk and all this type of seasoning you want to use in your cooking. That's not the point. Just take the point of the message and gala. But listen, look, man, I hope that helps you today on your Sunday. We've got a few... Hold on, wait. Oh, yo, hold on. Yo, it's Christmas next week. I yo, it's Christmas next week. Raw. I'm about to say we have a few more weeks. We don't have a few more weeks, bruv. We don't have a few more weeks. One more week until Christmas, or one more week until the new year. Martin. So listen, go ahead and do what you need to do to ensure you have a strong Sunday so that you can have a phenomenal week and a good setup for Christmas and the new year. Yeah? Double accent that was, but hey ho, I'm feeling very good today. About to go out, go to church, it's a good day. Hey, listen, let's go do this thing. Y'all have a blessed day. I'll speak to you guys soon. Big love, strength, love, and blessings. Adios. I'm feeling blessed, yeah, yeah. I'm feeling blessed, I'm feeling blessed. I need my blessings, yeah, yeah. I need my blessings, I need my blessings. Run it up, run it up, run it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Run it up, run it up, run it up. Also, listen, if you like that video, make sure, you know, you, you know what I'm going to say. Like, subscribe, join, join, follow, do all the things. Share it with a friend, write a comment, message me, all of that, all of that. I really do appreciate it when you guys engage. It helps a lot with my creativity and making these videos. Um, it shows me that's helping you guys as well. Um, not that I need it. I don't really need it, to be honest. I'm going to make them anyway, but it does help. And I, I, I do appreciate it. So no matter what platform you're working on, whatever I've said, whatever thing works with that. Yeah. I'm just going to stop there. Cause I'm just rambling on. Appreciate it. Bye-bye.